FDA warning, reactivation of hepatitis B virus This drug has a boxed warning. This is the most serious warning from the Food and Drug Administration, FDA, alerts doctors and patients about drug, show more what is Mavret. Mavret is a brand name prescription drug that's used to treat chronic hepatitis C virus, HCV. This virus infects your liver and causes inflammation. Mavret can be used by people with any of the six types of HCV who either don't have cirrhosis, liver scarring, or who have compensated, mild, cirrhosis. Mavret can also be used to treat HCV type 1 in people who have been previously treated, but not cured, with a different type of medication. Mavaret is approved for use in adults. It's also approved for use in children ages 12 years and older, or those weighing at least 45 kilograms, about 99 pounds. Mavaret comes as a single tablet that contains two antiviral medications, glucaprovir, 100 mg, and pubrentisvir, 40 mg. It's taken by mouth once each day. Effectiveness in Clinical Trials Adults with HCV, types 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, who had never been treated for the virus were given Mavaret. Of these people, 98% to 100% were cured after 8 to 12 weeks of treatment. In these studies, being cured meant that people's blood tests, which were done 3 months after treatment, showed no signs of HCV infection in their body. For more information on effectiveness, see the effectiveness section under Mavaret for hepatitis C below. FDA approval Mavaret was approved by the Food and Drug Administration, FDA, in April 2017 to treat chronic hepatitis C virus, types 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, in adults. In April 2019, the FDA extended the drug's approval to include its use in children. It's approved for use in children ages 12 years and older, or those weighing at least 45 kilograms, about 99 pounds. Mavaret Generic Mavaret is available only as a brand name medication. It's not currently available in generic form. Mavaret contains two active drug ingredients. Glucaprovir and Vibrentisvir. Mavaret cost is with all medications, the cost of Mavaret can vary. To find current prices for Mavaret in your area, check out goodrx.com. Mavaret 21 tablets of 100 mg 40 mg packages, T4, $13,474 GoodRx fair price The cost you find on GoodRx.com is what you may pay without insurance. The actual price you'll pay depends on your insurance plan, your location, and the pharmacy you use. Financial and insurance assistance If you need financial support to pay for Maverette, or if you need help understanding your insurance coverage, help is available. Abvi the manufacturer of Mavaret offers a program called Mavaret Patient Support, which may offer help to lower your cost of the drug. For more information and to find out if you're eligible for support, call 877-628-9738 or visit the program website. Mavaret Side Effects Mavaret can cause mild or serious side effects. The following lists contain some of the key side effects that may occur while taking Mavaret. These lists do not include all possible side effects. For more information on the possible side effects of Mavaret, talk with your doctor or pharmacist. They can give you tips on how to deal with any side effects that may be bothersome. More common side effects The more common side effects of Mavaret can include headache, feeling tired, nausea, diarrhea, elevated bilirubin level. A lab test that checks your liver function most of these side effects may go away within a few days or a couple of weeks. If they're more severe or don't go away, talk with your doctor or pharmacist. Serious side effects Serious side effects from Mavaret aren't common, but they can occur. Call your doctor right away if you have serious side effects.
Call 911 if your symptoms feel life-threatening or if you think you're having a medical emergency. Serious side effects, which are discussed below in side effect details, include the following hepatitis B virus reactivation, a flare-up of the virus. If it's already inside your body, severe allergic reaction Mavret has a box warning from the FDA for hepatitis B reactivation. A boxed warning is the strongest warning the FDA requires. It alerts doctors and patients about drug effects that may be dangerous. Side effect details You may wonder how often certain side effects occur with this drug, or whether certain side effects pertain to it. Here's some detail on some of the side effects this drug may or may not cause. Allergic reaction As with most drugs, some people can have an allergic reaction after taking Mavret. It's not known for sure how often people taking this drug have an allergic reaction. Symptoms of a mild allergic reaction can include skin rash, itchiness, flushing, warmth and redness in your skin. A more severe allergic reaction is rare but possible. Symptoms of a severe allergic reaction can include swelling under your skin, typically in your eyelids, lips, hands, or feet swelling of your tongue, mouth, or throat trouble breathing or speaking. Call your doctor right away if you have a severe allergic reaction to Mavret. Call 911 if your symptoms feel life-threatening or if you think you're having a medical emergency. Itching You may experience itching while you're using Mavret. In clinical trials, some people had itching while taking this drug. Itching most often occurred only in people taking the drug who had both chronic kidney disease and hepatitis C virus, HCV. In this group, about 17% of people reported itching as a side effect. Itching is also sometimes a symptom caused by HCV. Itching occurs in about 20% of people with HCV. This symptom is probably due to a buildup of a chemical called bilirubin in your body. Itching caused by HCV may be in one area or it may be all over your body. If you have concerns about having itchy skin while you're taking Mavaret, talk with your doctor. They can recommend ways to help reduce this side effect while you're using the drug. Hepatitis B reactivation You may have an increased risk of hepatitis B virus, HBV, reactivation, flare-up, while you're taking Mavret. Mavret treatment increases the risk of HBV reactivation in people with both HBV and HCV. In serious cases, reactivation of HBV can cause liver failure or even death. Symptoms of HBV reactivation can include pain in the right side of your belly like colored stool feeling tired yellowing of your skin or the whites of your eyes before starting Mavaret. Your doctor will test you for HBV. If you have HBV, you may need to be treated for it before you start taking Mavaret. Or your doctor may recommend testing during your Mavaret treatment to monitor for HBV reactivation and treat the condition if needed. Weight changes, not a side effect weight loss and weight gain weren't reported as side effects of Mavaret during clinical trials. However, Mavaret can cause nausea, which may lead to weight loss in some people. If you feel nauseous while taking this drug, you're likely to eat less food, which may result in weight loss. If you have concerns about weight gain or weight loss while you're taking Mavaret, Talk with your doctor. They can help you plan a healthy diet during your treatment. Skin rash, not a side effect. Skin rash wasn't reported as a side effect of Mavret during clinical trials. However, HCV itself can sometimes cause a skin rash. This may be mistaken for a side effect of the drug. The rash caused by HCV can be anywhere on your body, including your face, chest, or arms. It also might make you feel itchy. If you have a skin rash while using Mavaret, talk with your doctor.
they can suggest ways to reduce your symptoms and recommend treatment if needed. Side effects in children during clinical studies, side effects seen in children, ages 12 to 17, taking Mavret were similar to side effects seen in adults taking the drug. In these studies, no children stopped treatment because of side effects. Common side effects seen in children included feeling tired nausea headache elevated bilirubin level, a lab test that checks your liver function if you're concerned about side effects occurring in a child using Mavaret, talk with your doctor, they may be able to recommend ways to reduce these side effects during treatment. Mavaret dosage The following information describes dosages that are commonly used or recommended. However, be sure to take the dosage your doctor prescribes for you. Your doctor will determine the best dosage to suit your needs. Drug forms and strengths Mavaret comes as a tablet that's taken by mouth. Each tablet contains 100 mg of glucaprovir and 40 mg of piprendesvir. Dosage for hepatitis Dosage of Mavaret for chronic hepatitis C virus, HCV, is three tablets taken by mouth once each day. This drug should be taken with food. It should also be taken at about the same time each day. Your doctor will determine how long you need to take Mavaret. This decision depends on any previous HCV treatments you've used. Each person's treatment length can differ but most people take Mavaret anywhere from 8 weeks to 16 weeks. The typical length of Mavaret treatment is as follows. If you've never been treated for HCV, and you don't have cirrhosis, liver scarring, you'll likely be treated for 8 weeks. If you've never been treated for HCV, and you have compensated, mild, cirrhosis, you'll likely be treated for 12 weeks. If you've been previously treated for HCV, and your treatment wasn't effective, didn't cure your infection, your treatment length with Mavaret can vary. It might last anywhere from 8 weeks up to 16 weeks. The exact length of your treatment will depend on which HCV treatments you've used in the past. If you have any questions about how long you'll need to take Mavaret, talk with your doctor. They can recommend the best treatment plan for you. Pediatric dosage The pediatric dosage of Mavaret is the same as it is for adults, three tablets taken by mouth, with food, once each day. Pediatric dosing applies to children ages 12 to 17 years, or those who weigh at least 45 kilograms, about 99 pounds Mavaret is not. Currently approved for use in children younger than 12 years of age or in those who weigh less 45 kilograms. What if I miss a dose? If you miss a dose of Mavaret, here's what you should do. If it's less than 18 hours from when you should have taken Mavaret, go ahead and take your dose as soon as you remember. Then, take your next dose at the usual time. If it's more than 18 hours from when you should have taken Mavaret, just skip that dose. You can take your next dose at the usual time. To help make sure you don't miss a dose, try setting a reminder on your phone. A medication timer may be useful, too. Will I need to use this drug long term? The length of time that you'll need to take Mavaret depends on a couple of things. These include whether you've ever been treated for HCV before, and if you have any, liver scarring, cirrhosis. Typically, treatment with Mavaret lasts anywhere from 8 to 16 weeks. It usually doesn't last longer than 16 weeks. Mavaret and alcohol Mavaret doesn't have any known interactions with alcohol. However, you shouldn't drink alcohol if you have hepatitis C virus, HCV. Alcohol makes HCV worse, which can lead to severe scarring, cirrhosis, in your liver. If you drink alcohol, and you're concerned about how to stop drinking, talk with your doctor. Alternatives to Mavaret Other drugs are available that can treat chronic hepatitis C virus, HCV. Some may be better suited for you than others.
If you're interested in finding an alternative to Mavaret, talk with your doctor. They can tell you about other medications that may work well for you. Alternative medications, which contain a combination of antiviral drugs to treat HCV, include the following Ledipasvir and Sofosbuvir, Harvani Sofosbuvir and Belpatasvir, Epclusa Belpatasvir, Sofosbuvir, and Voxilaprevir, Visevi Albasavir and Grisoprevir, Zepatir Semeprevir, Elysio, and Sofosbuvir, Sivaldi Although they don't come as a combination drug, Semeprevir, Elysio, and Sofosbuvir, Sivaldi may also be taken together to treat HCV. Mavaret versus Harvani You may wonder how Mavaret compares to other medications that are prescribed for similar uses. Here we look at how Mavaret and Harvani are alike and different. About Mavaret contains the drugs Glucaprovir and Vibrentisvir. Harvani contains the drugs Ladipasvir and Sofosbuvir. Both Mavaret and Harvani contain a combination of antivirals, and they belong to the same class of medications. Uses Mavaret is approved to treat chronic hepatitis C virus, HCV, in adults. It's also approved for use in children ages 12 years or older, or those who weigh at least 45 kilograms, which is about 99 pounds. Mavaret is used to treat all types, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6 of HCV in people with no liver scarring, cirrhosis, or in those who have cirrhosis without any symptoms of the condition who, have received a liver or kidney transplant will have hive mobby wire it can also be used to treat HCV type 1 in people who have been previously treated, but not cured, with a different type of medication. Harvani is approved to treat HCV in adults. It can be used to treat the following types of HCV types 1, 2, 5, or 6 in people with no liver scarring, cirrhosis, or in those who have cirrhosis without any symptoms of the condition type 1 in people who have cirrhosis with symptoms of the condition. In these people, Harvani should be combined with ribavirin type 1 or 4 in people who have received a liver transplant, and either don't have liver scarring, or have liver scarring without symptoms. In these people, Harvani should also be combined with ribavirin. Harvani is also approved for use in children ages 12 years and older or those who weigh at least 35 kilograms, which is about 77 pounds. It can be used in the following children those with HCV types 1, 4, 5, or 6 children without liver scarring, cirrhosis, or those with cirrhosis but, who have no symptoms of the condition drug forms in administration Mavaret comes as tablets, which are taken by mouth, with food, once each day. It's usually given for a period of 8, 12, or 16 weeks depending on your treatment history and how severe your liver disease is. Harvani also comes as tablets, which are taken by mouth, with or without food, once each day. It's usually given over a period of 8, 12, or 24 weeks depending on your treatment history and the condition of your liver. Side effects and risks Mavaret and Harvani do not contain the same drugs, but they are part of the same class of medications. These medications can cause some similar side effects and some different side effects. Below are examples of these side effects. More common side effects These lists contain examples of more common side effects that can occur with Mavaret, with Harvani, or with both drugs when taken individually, can occur with Mavaret diarrhea elevated bilirubin level. A lab test that checks your liver function can occur with Harvani feeling weak insomnia, trouble sleeping cough feeling irritable can occur with both Mavaret and Harvani headache feeling tired nausea serious side effects serious side effects that can occur with both Mavaret and Harvani, when taken individually, include the following hepatitis B virus reactivation, a flare-up of the virus, if it's already inside your body. Severe allergic reaction Mavaret and Harvani both have a boxed warning from the FDA for hepatitis B reactivation. A boxed warning is the strongest warning the FDA requires. It alerts doctors and patients about drug effects that may be dangerous. Effectiveness Both Mavaret and Harvani are approved to treat chronic hepatitis C virus, HCV. However, one medication may be more effective for you than the other. 
depending on the type of HCVU, have and whether you have any liver scarring, cirrhosis. These drugs haven't been directly compared in clinical studies. But separate studies have found that both Mavaret and Harvani are effective in treating HCV costs. Mavaret and Harvani are both brand name drugs. There are currently no generic forms of either drug. Brand name medications usually cost more than generics. According to estimates on GoodRx.com, Mavaret and Harvani generally cost about the same. The actual price you'll pay for either drug depends on your insurance plan, your location, and the pharmacy you use. Mavaret vs. At Clusa you may wonder how Mavaret compares to other medications that are prescribed for similar uses. Here we look at how Mavaret and Apclusa are alike and different. About Mavaret contains the drugs Glucaprovir and Vibrantisvir. Apclusa contains the drugs Velpatisvir and Sofospavir. Both Mavaret and Apclusa contain a combination of antiviral drugs and they belong to the same class of medications. Uses Mavaret is approved to treat chronic hepatitis C virus, HCV, in adults. It's also approved for use in children ages 12 years or older, or those who weigh at least 45 kilograms, which is about 99 pounds. Mavaret is used to treat all types, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, of HCV in people with no liver scarring, cirrhosis, or in those who have cirrhosis without any symptoms of the condition who have received a liver or kidney transplant will have hive mobby wire. It can also be used to treat HCV type 1 in people who've been previously treated, but not cured, with a different type of medication. Much like Mavaret, Epclusa is also approved to treat chronic HCV caused by all types of the virus, types 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. It's used in adults who don't have liver scarring, cirrhosis, or in those with liver scarring who don't have any symptoms of the condition. Epclusa can also be used in adults with cirrhosis who have symptoms of the condition. Epclusa is not approved for use in children. Drug forms and administration Mavaret comes as tablets, which are taken by mouth, with food once each day. It's usually given for a period of 8, 12, or 16 weeks depending on your treatment history and how severe your liver disease is. Epclusa also comes as tablets, which are taken by mouth once each day. Epclusa can be taken with or without food. It's usually given for a period of 12 weeks. Side effects and risks Mavaret and Epclusa do not have the same drugs in them. However, they belong to the same class of medications. Therefore, both medications can cause similar side effects. Below are examples of these side effects. More common side effects These lists contain examples of more common side effects that can occur with Mavaret, with Epclusa, or with both drugs, when taken individually. Can occur with Mavaret diarrhea elevated bilirubin level. A lab test that checks your liver function can occur with Epclusa feeling weak insomnia, trouble sleeping can occur with both Mavaret and Epclusa headache feeling tired nausea serious side effects serious side effects that can occur with both Mavaret and Epclusa, when taken individually, include the following hepatitis B virus reactivation, a flare-up of the virus, if it's already inside your body. Severe allergic reaction Mavaret and Epclusa both have a boxed warning from the FDA for hepatitis B reactivation. A boxed warning is the strongest warning the FDA requires. It alerts doctors and patients about drug effects that may be dangerous. Effectiveness Mavaret and Epclusa are both used to treat all six types of chronic HCV. Your doctor may recommend that you take either Epclusa or Mavaret depending on the type of HCV you have and the condition of your liver. These drugs haven't been directly compared in clinical studies. But separate studies have found that both Mavaret and Epclusa are effective in treating HCV costs. Mavaret and Epclusa are both brand name drugs. There are currently no generic forms of either drug. 
Brand name medications usually cost more than generics. According to estimates on GoodRx.com, Mavarad and Epclusa generally cost about the same. The actual price you'll pay for either drug depends on your insurance plan, your location, and the pharmacy you use. Mavaret for Hepatitis Food and Drug Administration, FDA, approves prescription drugs such as Mavaret to treat certain conditions. Mavaret is FDA approved to treat chronic infections caused by Hepatitis C virus, HCV. This virus infects your liver and causes inflammation, which can sometimes lead to liver scarring, called cirrhosis. HCV can cause symptoms such as yellowing of your skin and the whites of your eyes fluid build up in your belly fever long-term problems, such as liver failure HICV is spread through blood that's infected with the virus. Transmission, spreading, happens most commonly through people sharing used needles with each other. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, CDC, in 2016 about 2.4 million people in the United States had chronic hepatitis C. Mavaret is approved to treat HCV in adults. It's also approved for use in children ages 12 years or older, or those who weigh at least 45 kilograms, which is about 99 pounds. It's used to treat all HCV types, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, in people with no liver scarring, cirrhosis, or in those who have cirrhosis without any symptoms of the condition, called compensated cirrhosis who, have received a liver or kidney transplant will have hive mobby wire. It can also be used to treat HCV type 1 in people who have been previously treated, but not cured, with a different type of medication. Effectiveness in Clinical Trials, Adults with HCV, Types 1 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, who had never been treated for the virus were given Mavaret. Of these people, 98% to 100% were cured within 8 to 12 weeks of treatment. In these studies, being cured meant that people's blood tests, which were done 3 months after treatment, showed no signs of HCV infection in their body. Of all people in the studies, both those who had been previously treated for HCV, and those who had not been, between 92% and 100% were cured of HCV. The results varied depending on whether the people had been previously treated and on the type of HCV they had. Clinical trials also compared Mavaret to the combination of two other antiviral drugs called Cefospivir, Cevaldi, and Declatistor, Declinza. One study looked at people with HCV type 3, who'd never been treated before. These people didn't have any liver scaring, cirrhosis. After 12 weeks, 95.3% of people taking Mavaret were considered cured, they had no HCV virus in their blood tests. Of those taking Cefospivir and Declatistor, 96.5% had the same result. Mavaret for children Mavaret is approved to treat HCV in children ages 12 years and older, or in those weighing at least 45 kilograms, which is about 99 pounds. Mavaret interactions Mavaret can interact with several other medications. It can also interact with certain supplements. Different interactions can cause different effects. For instance, some interactions can interfere with how well a drug works. Other interactions can increase side effects or make them more severe. Mavaret and other medications below are lists of medications that can interact with Mavaret. These lists do not contain all the drugs that may interact with Mavaret. Before taking Mavaret, talk with your doctor and pharmacist. Tell them about all prescription over-the-counter, and other drugs you take. Also tell them about any vitamins, herbs, and supplements you use. Sharing this information can help you avoid potential interactions. If you have questions about drug interactions that may affect you, ask your doctor or pharmacist. Mavaret and carbamazepine, 
Tegretol taking carbamazepine with Mavaret could decrease the amount of Mavaret in your body. This could cause the medication to not work as well, which may lead to your hepatitis C virus, HCV, not being fully treated. It's important to avoid taking carbamazepine and Mavaret together. Mavaret and Warfarin Coumadin taking warfarin with Mavarad can change the level of warfarin in your body. This may lead to changes in the thickness of your blood, causing it to become either too thin or too thick. If this happens, you may be at risk for certain complications, such as bleeding or having blood clots. If you're taking Mavarad with warfarin, it's important to get certain blood tests done frequently to check the thickness of your blood. If you need to take these medications together, your doctor will recommend ways to help ensure your safety during treatment. Mavaret and Dejoxin Lenoxin taking Mavaret with Dejoxin can increase levels of Dejoxin in your body. This can cause symptoms such as nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, irregular heart rhythm. If you're taking Dejoxin while you're using Mavaret, your doctor may need to lower your dose of Dejoxin. This will help prevent your dejoxin levels from getting too high and causing side effects. Your doctor may check your dejoxin levels on blood tests more often than usual while you're taking Mavaret. Mavaret and Dabigatran, Pradaxa taking Mavaret with Dabigatran increases the levels of Dabigatran in your body. If this level gets too high, you'll have an increased risk of bleeding or bruising. You may also feel weak. These symptoms can sometimes be serious. If you're taking dabigatran while you're using Mavaret, your doctor may need to lower your dosage of dabigatran. This will help to prevent these symptoms from happening. Mavaret and Rifampin Rifidin taking Mavaret with Rifampin lowers the levels of Mavaret in your body. If the level of Mavaret in your body is lowered, the drug may not work as well to treat HCV. You should avoid taking Mavaret and Rifampin at the same time. Mavaret and certain birth control medications Some birth control medications contain a drug called ethanol estradiol. Taking this drug in combination with Mavaret can increase your body's levels of a certain liver enzyme called alanine aminotransferase, ALT. Increased ALT levels can make your hepatitis symptoms worse. It's recommended that you don't use birth control containing ethanol estradiol while you're taking Mavaret. Examples of birth control pills that contain ethanol estradiol include levonorgestrel and ethanol estradiol, lysina, labora, seasonic desigestrol and ethanol estradiol, opry, carivanorethendrone and ethanol estradiol, balziva, junel, loestrin slash loestrin fe, microgestin slash microgestin fe norgestrol and ethanol, estradiol, crizel. Low slash overall drospirinone and ethanol estradiol, lorina, yes norgestimate and ethanol estradiol, ortho tricycline slash ortho tricycline low, sprintec, trisprintec, trinesa. This is not a complete list of birth control pills that contain ethanol estradiol. If you aren't sure if your birth control has ethanol estradiol in it, be sure to ask your doctor or pharmacist. Some other methods of birth control besides pills also contain ethanol estradiol. These methods include the contraceptive patch, orthoevra, and the vaginal ring, nuba ring. If you're using birth control that contains ethanol estradiol, talk with your doctor about other options to prevent pregnancy while you're taking Mavaret. Mavaret and certain HIV antiviral medications Certain HIV medications, called antivirals, can affect the amount of Mavaret in your body. Examples of antiviral drugs that may alter the amount of Mavaret in your body include Adazanavir, Rayatastarunavir, Prezistilopinavir and Ritonavir, Kalitra Ritonavir, Norvir Favarens, Sestiva Adazanavir should never be taken with Mavaret. Taking these drugs together increases your body's level of a certain liver enzyme called alanine aminotransferase, ALT. Increased ALT levels can make your hepatitis symptoms worse. 
Taking Mavaret with Darunavir, Lopinavir, or Ritonavir is also not recommended. This is because these antiviral drugs can increase the levels of Mavaret in your body. This can lead to increased side effects from Mavaret. Taking Mavaret with Afavarens decreases the levels of Mavaret in your body. This may cause Mavaret to not work as well. You should avoid using Afavarens while taking Mavaret. Mavaret and certain cholesterol medications taking Mavaret along with certain cholesterol medications called statins may increase the level of the statin in your body. Having increased levels of statins increases your risk of side effects, such as muscle pain, from the statin. Examples of statins include atorvastatin, lipitor lovastatin, mevacor simvastatin, zocor pravastatin, pravacol rosuvastatin, crestor fluvastatin, lescol pitavastatin. Livolo is recommended that you don't take Mavret in combination with atorvastatin, lovastatin, or simvastatin. These statins have the highest risk of increased side effects when they're taken with Mavret. Pravastatin can be taken with Mavaret if your doctor recommends that you need a cholesterol medication. Your dosage of Pravastatin will need to be lowered before you start taking Mavaret. This will help to reduce your risk of side effects from the statin. If Fluvastatin and Pitavastatin are taken with Mavaret, they should be given at the lowest possible dosage. This helps reduce your risk of having increased side effects from the statins. Mavaret and Cyclosporin Sandimune Mavaret is not recommended for use in people who are taking more than 100 mg per day of Cyclosporin. This drug increases the levels of Mavaret in your body, which can increase your risk of side effects from Mavaret. If you're taking Cyclosporin, Talk with your doctor about what dosage of cyclosporin is safest for you. Mavaret and omeprazole, not an interaction. There aren't any known interactions between omeprazole and Mavaret. Omeprazole is sometimes given to people taking Mavaret if they're having nausea during treatment. Sometimes, nausea is caused by acid buildup in your stomach. Taking omeprazole will help lower the amount of acid in your stomach, which can help reduce this side effect. Mavaret and ibuprofen, not an interaction. There aren't any known interactions between ibuprofen and Mavaret. Ibuprofen can be used to treat headaches in people taking Mavaret. Headaches are a common side effect that may occur when you're taking Mavaret. Ibuprofen can help reduce the pain and discomfort of a headache. Mavaret and herbs and supplements Mavaret can interact with some herbs and supplements, including Street John's Wort, which is detailed below. These interactions may affect how Mavaret works in your body. You should review all of the medications you take, including any herbs and supplements, with your doctor or pharmacist before you start taking Mavaret. Mavaret and St. John's Wort taking Street John's wort with Mavaret can greatly decrease the levels of Mavaret in your body. This can cause Mavaret to not work as well in treating your hepatitis C infection. It's recommended that you don't take street. John's wort while you're using Mavaret. Mavaret and pregnancy There haven't been any studies in humans looking at whether or not Mavaret is safe to take during pregnancy. In animal studies, no harm was seen in fetuses whose mothers were given Mavaret during pregnancy. However, the results of animal studies don't always predict what will happen in humans. If you're pregnant or may become pregnant while using Mavaret, talk with your doctor. They can discuss with you the risks and benefits of using this drug during pregnancy. Mavaret and breastfeeding There haven't been any studies in humans to know whether or not Mavaret passes into breast milk, or if it has any effect on a breastfeeding child. In animal studies, Mavaret did pass into the milk of lactating rats. However, 
This milk did not cause harm to the animals who consumed it. Keep in mind that these results may be different in humans. If you're breastfeeding, or planning to breastfeed while taking Mavaret, talk with your doctor about whether this is a safe option. They may recommend other healthy ways to feed your child. How to take Mavaret You should take Mavaret according to your doctor or healthcare provider's instructions. When to take it doesn't matter what time of day you choose to take Mavaret, but you should take it at about the same time each day. This helps the medication work the right way inside your body. To help make sure you don't miss a dose, try setting a reminder on your phone. A medication timer may be useful, too. Taking Mavaret with food Mavaret should be taken with food. This helps your body to better absorb the medication. Can Mavaret be crushed, split, or chewed? No, Mavaret shouldn't be split, crushed, or chewed. The tablets are meant to be swallowed whole. Splitting, crushing, or chewing them can decrease the amount of drug that gets into your body. This can cause Mavaret to not work as well in treating your hepatitis C infection. How Mavaret works Mavaret is approved to treat chronic hepatitis C virus, HCV. This virus causes an infection in your body that affects your liver. HCV can lead to severe liver damage if it's not treated the right way. Mavaret contains two drugs, glucaprovir and vibrantisvir. It works by stopping the hepatitis C virus from multiplying, making more virus, inside your body. Because the virus isn't able to multiply, it will eventually die off. Once all of the virus has died, and it's no longer inside your body, your liver can begin to heal. Mavaret works to treat all six types, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, of HCV. How long does it take to work? During clinical studies, 92% to 100% people with HCV were cured after taking Mavaret for their prescribed length of time. This length of time ranged from 8 to 16 weeks. In these studies, being cured meant that people's blood tests, which were done three months after treatment, showed no signs of HCV infection in their body. Common questions about Mavaret Here are answers to some frequently asked questions about Mavaret. Can I take Mavaret if I have HIV and Hepatitis C? Yes. You can take Mavaret if you have both HIV and Hepatitis C virus, HCV. Having HIV doesn't change the way that Mavaret works in your body to treat HCV. How successful is Mavaret at curing Hepatitis C? Mavaret has been shown to be very effective in curing Hepatitis C virus, HCV, infections. In clinical trials, between 98% and 100% of people taking Mavaret were cured of HCV. In these studies, being cured meant that people's blood tests, which were done three months after treatment, showed no signs of HCV infection. The percentage of people who were cured depended on the type of HCV they had, and what kind of treatments they'd used in the past. If I've taken other hepatitis C treatments, can I use Mavaret? If you've tried other medications for your hepatitis C that haven't worked, cured your infection, you can likely still use Mavaret. Depending on what drugs you've used in the past, your treatment length with Mavaret could be anywhere from 8 to 16 weeks. If you have questions about whether you can use Mavaret, talk with your doctor. Will I need any tests before or during Mavaret treatment? Before you start treatment with Mavaret, your doctor will test your blood for hepatitis B virus, HBV. If you have HBV, it can reactivate, flare up, during Mavaret treatment. Reactivation of HBV can cause severe liver problems, including liver failure and death. If you have HBV, your doctor will recommend blood tests during your Mavaret treatment to check for HBV reactivation. You may need to be treated for HBV before you start taking Mavaret. Can I use Mavaret if I have cirrhosis? 
You may be able to, but it depends on how severe your cirrhosis, liver scarring, is. Mavarad can be used if you have compensated, mild, cirrhosis. With this condition, your liver has scarring, but you don't have any symptoms of the condition and your liver is still working normally. Mavarad is not yet approved for use in people with decompensated cirrhosis. With this condition, your liver has scarring and you have symptoms of the condition. Symptoms can include yellowing of your skin or the whites of your eyes extra fluid in your belly and large blood vessels in your throat, which may cause bleeding if you have cirrhosis but aren't sure what kind. Talk with your doctor. Mavarad precautions This drug comes with several precautions. FDA warning. Hepatitis B virus reactivation This drug has a boxed warning. This is the most serious warning from the Food and Drug Administration, FDA. A boxed warning alerts doctors and patients about drug effects that may be dangerous. Mavaret treatment increases the risk of hepatitis B virus, HBV, reactivation, flare-up, in people with both HBV and hepatitis C virus, HCV. In serious cases, reactivation of HBV can cause liver failure or even death. Before starting Mavaret, your doctor will test you for HBV. If you have HBV, you may need to be treated for it before you start taking Mavaret, or your doctor may recommend testing during your Mavaret treatment to check for HBV reactivation. Other warnings before taking Mavaret. Talk with your doctor about your health history. Avarat may not be right for you if you have certain medical conditions. These include liver failure. If you have liver failure, taking Mavaret may worsen your condition. Talk with your doctor if you have any history of liver disease or liver failure before starting treatment with Mavaret. Current use of Atazanivir or Rifampin. Mavarat should never be used in people taking either atazanivir or rifampin. Taking Mavarat and rifampin together may decrease Mavarat levels in your body. This can make Mavarat less effective for you. Taking atazanivir with Mavarat can increase in the amount of Mavarat in your body. This can increase levels of a liver enzyme, called alanine aminotransferase, which can become dangerous. See the Mavarat Interactions section for more information. Always talk to your doctor about any medications that you're taking before you start Mavarat. Pregnancy. It's not known whether Mavarat can affect a developing pregnancy. In animal studies, Mavarat did not cause harm when used during pregnancy. However, this result may be different in humans. For more information, Please see the Mavaret in Pregnancy section above. Breastfeeding. It's not known if Mavaret passes into human breast milk, or if it harms a breastfeeding child. In animal studies, Mavaret did pass into breast milk, but it did not cause harm to animals who consumed the breast milk. However, this result may be different in humans. For more information, Please see the Mavaret in breastfeeding section above. Note, for more information about the potential negative effects of Mavaret, see the Mavaret side effects section above. Mavaret overdose using more than the recommended dosage of Mavaret can lead to serious side effects. Never take more than the dosage your doctor prescribes for you. What to do in case of overdose if you think you've taken too much of this drug? Call your doctor. You can also call the American Association of Poison Control Centers at 800-222-1222 or use their online tool. But if your symptoms are severe, call 911 or go to the nearest emergency room right away. Mavaret expiration, storage, and disposal When you get Mavaret from the pharmacy, the pharmacist will add an expiration date to the label on the bottle. This date is typically one year from the date they dispense the medication. The expiration date helps guarantee the effectiveness of the medication during this time. 
The current stance of the Food and Drug Administration, FDA, is to avoid using expired medications. If you have unused medication that has gone past the expiration date, talk to your pharmacist about whether you might still be able to use it. Storage How long a medication remains good can depend on many factors, including how and where you store the medication. Avarad tablets should be stored at room temperature, below 86 degrees Fahrenheit 30 degrees Celsius, in a tightly sealed container, away from light. Avoid storing this medication in areas where it could get damp or wet, such as in bathrooms. Disposal If you no longer need to take Mavaret and have leftover medication, it's important to dispose of it safely. This helps prevent others, including children and pets, from taking the drug by accident. It also helps keep the drug from harming the environment. The FDA website provides several useful tips on medication disposal. You can also ask your pharmacist for information on how to dispose of your medication. Professional information for Mavaret The following information is provided for clinicians and other healthcare professionals. Indications Mavaret is indicated for the treatment of chronic hepatitis C virus, HCV, genotypes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Mavaret is approved for use in adults and children ages 12 years and older, or those who weigh at least 45 kilograms. It should only be used in patients without cirrhosis, or in those with compensated cirrhosis. Mavaret is also indicated to treat genotype 1 hepatitis C virus infection in people whose previous treatments were unsuccessful. These prior treatments should include either an HCV NS5A inhibitor or an NS3-4A protease inhibitor. Mavaret is not indicated for use in patients whose prior treatment failed using both an HCV NS5A inhibitor and an NS3-4A protease inhibitor. Mechanism of action Mavaret contains glucaprovir and pibrentisvir. These drugs are direct-acting antiviral medications that fight HCV. Glucaprovir is an NS3-4A protease inhibitor. It works by targeting NS3-4A protease, which is necessary for the development of hepatitis C virus. The Brentisvir is an NS5A inhibitor. By blocking NS5A. The Brentisvir essentially stops hepatitis C viral replication. Mavaret is effective against hepatitis C virus genotypes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Pharmacokinetics and metabolism in a study involving non HCV infected people who were considered healthy, absorption of Mavaret was greatly affected by the presence of food. When taken with a meal, Glucaprovir absorption increased by 83% to 163%. Absorption of Puprentisvir was increased by 40% to 53%. Therefore, Mavaret is recommended to be taken with food to enhance its absorption. Maximum plasma concentration of Mavaret occurs at about 5 hours post-dose. The half-life of Glucaprovir is 6 hours, while the half-life of Bibrentisvir is 13 hours. Mavaret is mainly excreted via the biliary fecal route. The majority of both Glucaprovir and Bibrentisvir is plasma protein bound. Contraindications Mavaret is contraindicated in patients with severe hepatic disease, defined as child PUC score. Mavaret is also contraindicated in patients that are taking either atazanavir or rifampin. The concentration of Mavaret is greatly decreased by rifampin, which may reduce or inhibit the therapeutic effect of Mavaret. Mavaret should not be taken with atazanavir because the combination of drugs can increase alanine aminotransferase, ALT, levels, leading to increased risk of liver failure. Storage Mavaret should be stored at or below 86 degrees Fahrenheit, 30 degrees Celsius, in a sealed, dry container.
Disclaimer, Medical News Today has made every effort to make certain that all information is factually correct, comprehensive, and up-to-date. However, this article should not be used as a substitute for the knowledge and expertise of a licensed healthcare professional. You should always consult your doctor or other healthcare professional before taking any medication. The drug information contained herein is subject to change and is not intended to cover all possible uses, directions, precautions, warnings, drug interactions, allergic reactions, or adverse effects. The absence of warnings or other information for a given drug does not indicate that the drug or drug combination is safe, effective, or appropriate for all patients or all specific uses.